our paper is, I think it's described internationally as a moderate paper. We are trying not to preach to the converted. Our converted would be the more liberal section on, or, and the more elitist liberal section of the population. Uh, we try not to preach only to them. In fact, our readership stretches from to the total spectrum of South African politics and is fairly representative of the demographics of the country. We have more black readers than white readers. We have more government white supporting readers than anti-government. We have a very high proportion, not a big readership, but a very high proportion of the population of Indian readers and of colored readers, uh, mixed blood readers. Uh, the, the readership is divided up by the racial laws, but we have a single vast readership. And I perceive the role of this newspaper is simply trying to communicate between that full spectrum. We are anti-apartheid without any qualification whatever and always have been. We have some sympathy with our Afrikaans readers and, and the government's fears of being swamped. We have sympathy for, although we do not support a revolutionary movement. We understand why there's a revolution. And really what we're trying to do is simply communicate the facts as far as we can, the opinions with, with less capability, and the views and the, and the interaction between these groups. And I think there is still a role there, but as I said, polarization is already has already reached the point where the same report means different things to two sets of readers. It's extraordinary. There are so many emotive words. Uh, and, uh, and I think it's becoming more difficult to communicate with our readers.